In this lesson, we will be discussing an overview of show motion. If you'd like to follow along with this video, please open the file 2101 overview of show motion.dwg located in the training folder as discussed in the working with this data set video. So what is show motion? Show motion allows you to visually navigate between named views in the current drawing. Activating the show motion panel displays thumbnail images of each named view defined in the drawing. When the named views have categories assigned to them, the named views are displayed by category. With show motion, you can play a slideshow that will automatically cycle through all the views in a category. You can choose to loop the slideshow so that it continues to play from the beginning until you stop it. You can also pause the show when necessary. Using show motion, you can add movement and transitions to named views and captured camera positions. These animated views are called shots. There are three types of shots, still, cinematic, and recorded walk. Each shot type has different shot properties. To access show motion, this is in the navigation bar. On the bottom, we have the show motion tool. When you click on that, this opens up the show motion control panel. I'll go ahead and pin this by clicking it on here. Notice that in the show motion control panel, we already have two categories. One which is none, which just has the default camera views in there. And then we have this one called viewing house, which was created. We have these seven named views that when we go to play this, you'll see it does a slideshow of all the named views. These named views also have properties which allow them to move left, move right, transition to other views, and so on. So as you can see, show motion really is a cool way to present your design in a nice presentation type way and save it to the file. To access any of the functionality in the show motion control panel, simply right click. You can then delete the categories. You can change properties of individual shots by right clicking on them as well. And as you can see here, you have the ability to change the properties on the fly if you wanted to. Let's go ahead and unpin this, click on the drawing view, and let's go to the home tab, views panel, and in the name views dropdown, you will notice that all that these are are simply name views with some additional shot properties. Again, those shot properties are located in the show motion control panel, and then you right click on the individual name view and simply go to the properties tool, and then you can edit any of the different properties that are being used by this named view. This concludes this video discussing an overview of show motion.